Hello everyone, welcome to our June edition of Chamber Highlights. Uh, Shannon and I are here with you today and we got some great folks coming on uh, to talk about you've been cooped up in the house all winter, you've done your spring cleaning and now you're outside. So why not let somebody come in and do some inside work for you? We're gonna be talking to three great chamber members today. First, we're gonna have uh, Tim Fortuna with Timbercraft Cabinets and Millwork. So he's gonna talk about those kitchen cabinets and uh, bathroom uh, cabinets that he makes. Very unique custom work that he does. Second, we're gonna have Lynn Carr Wiggins with Island Classic Interiors in Ocean Isle Beach with us. They cover a whole line of things. They have, they can decorate your home from just one room to one part of a room, all the way to a, a blank slate and decorate your house from one end to the other. Plus, they're gonna tell us about some other things that they have available right there in their shop that you need to stop by and see. Lastly, we're gonna have our chamber member from North Myrtle Beach here, More Space Place. They are called America's Murphy Bed Store and they will help you organize your house, which is a really great thing mm -hmm. to do in the summer months. Get organized and- Get ready for ready all those for, visitors. That's right. <laughs> so we're getting ready to get started. A couple things we wanna tell you about is a business after hours for the month of June is at Coral Tree uh, Spa. They will be co-hosted by Pretty in Pink Foundation, as well as there was another one. Damsels and Divas. Damsels and Divas. So at Coral Tree Salon that will Spa. Be Coral Tree Salon and Spa, and the date was June, June 27th. June 27th on Thursday, Thursday from 5.30 to 7. And also keep uh, an eye on our events calendar at BrunswickCountyChamber.org uh, under the tab for events so that you can keep up with an ever-changing schedule. There's all kinds of community events on there. Also the summer concert series is kicking off this month, so be looking at the calendar for those events too. And we'll be right back with our first guest. Welcome back, folks. We're here with Tim Fortuna of Timbercraft Cabinets and Millworks. Tim, welcome to the show today. We're glad Thank to you have for, you on. Thank you for welcome. having me. So, Tim, we've been sitting here talking a little bit today about what Timbercraft means and what Millworks means, and I have somewhat of an idea of what it means, but could you talk a little bit about how that plays a part into your business and what people get when they hear that you're a mill worker or you're in the Timbercraft business with your cabinets? Um, well, Tony, Millworks per pretty much uh, stands for the full spectrum of woodworking. Um, we buy all of our lumber like it's cut off the tree in the rough and then our equipment you know planes it uh, joins it and then we turn it into um, doors moldings uh, so basically we hand make everything in the back end there so in other words when you go you don't run down to Lowe's and buy or another store box store and buy moldings off the shelf and nail them together and make your cabinets and, no. and you cut everything there in the shop just yeah. like it comes from the, the lumber stores that sell to the other guys well what started it about 20 25 years ago I had to buy some cherry crown molding from a mill and they were like nine ten weeks out and I just didn't have the heart to tell the customer it was going to take that long. So I retooled an old planer of mine to make the moldings. Wow. So now I can make the molding in a day wow. rather than take eight, nine weeks. And that set a light bulb off. Yes. I can do this, all of this this way, right? Right. That's very cool. Right. Now, Tim, we got some cabinet, I guess these are door facings in yes. front of us. Door styles. Yeah. Door styles that uh, you offer to folks. Uh, and it looks like we've got some that are very intricately cut here. We have what you call the shaker style. And then this style was what? That's just a, a five piece uh, cope and rail uh, raised panel door with a distressed finish on it. So someone can come into your showroom then and say, they can look at these five along with, I'm sure, several others. Mm -hmm. They can pick out how the fronts look. Uh, they can pick out how it attaches to the ceiling with crown moldings. Correct. Uh, very ornate 
fascia boards, uh, all kinds of different opportunities to design it the way they want it as compared to going and buying a selection off of a shelf. That's correct. We have uh, five full kitchens in the showroom and uh, six little side venues of uh, vanities, um, entertainment units, stuff like that, fireplaces. And we try to put a little bit of different style in each one just to give the customer uh, a good selection of what they can actually have. But the more information that the customer uh, can give me, the better I can design their kitchen or entertainment units. Which, so, um, go ahead. Say, what's your most popular style from up here that people request? Right now, it, it, sometimes it's trendy. Um, you know, for a while it could be all painted products. Um, but today it's the shaker door. Uh, it's fine. the least expensive. Um, that might not be a color that somebody would like, but um, you can get it in natural maple, you can get it in cherry, uh, mahogany, alder, uh, solid color. Um, and you were telling me too, with uh, switching to colors there, that you can actually, you actually customize the colors, the paints, the stains. Uh, you can tweak it if somebody sees a little too much red in it and they want it browner. If it's a, something similar to this, they can do that. That is correct. We do our own in-house coloring with microtones. Wow. We have certain base colors that we work with and then, like you said, if the customer likes uh, maybe some of the red out of the cherry, you know, we'll throw some browns and black microtones into the mix to get it the shade that they want. And you also offer all the hardware that goes into it. It's almost like a one-stop shop for a customer to yes. design and build and have everything. Design, build, um, hardware, countertops. Um, we in-house we do cultured marble and solid um, and laminate. Uh, outside source, even though it's through Timbercraft, we do solid surfaces in granite. Also, cool. we offer that. I asked you um, before we were on the show uh, what your most unique product that you got to build. Would you share that with our audience? Um, about 20 years ago, I had built a kitchen out of mahogany for a customer up in Raleigh. And um, at the end of the project, he had literally drawn on a napkin uh, a French curve which is a device you use for drawing circles, odd shaped circles. And he said, I want the headpiece to look like this. And it was going to be a wine hutch that was going in his wine room because they were wine connoisseurs. So that was pretty much the extent of the design aspect from him. And then I had to put this piece together pretty much in my head. So um, I did a little research on some veneers, some exotic veneers, and I came up with a um, Nigerian bovinga, which has a yellowish hue to it uh, when you just shoot it with lacquer, and mahogany columns uh, that were really fat bull nose. I don't have a picture of it. I wished I did, but um, it was a very unique piece. And the headpiece was separate, but it looked like this big French curve. Mm -hmm. It was all solid mahogany. And um, once every maybe five to six years, a customer would commission me to build some very rare piece of furniture. And the results were pretty nice. And when he sold his house, him and his wife, that was the deal clencher that the new customers wanted that hutch. Wow. That's how beautiful it was. Wow. And that sold the house for them. And so this was a commission piece, and you were telling me before we went on air that you actually enjoy that on occasion because it brings out the art, artistic side of you. You're able to put the art to it, and it becomes more than just the craft, and it becomes an art to you when you do that? Well, it's a woodworker's dream, really, because you're doing it more for the love of it. I mean, it was, a, it was an expensive piece. It was like $16,000 wow. to do this piece. But truly, I had far more hours and material in it than that. So you really do it for the love of it. And actually, the end product, when you're looking at it, 
And then the story that the customer can call you back and say that, that mm -hmm. that was part of the deal on the sell of the home. You know, that wow. just makes you feel good. Sure, mm -hmm. sure. So with all that said, we're ta if someone that's watching the show today wants to call you up and they're getting ready to either build a new house on the beach, build a new house somewhere in one of the golf communities or just right in town for that matter, and they want to customize their cabinetry, their home entertainment centers and all uh, from one end of the house to the other, they can call Timbercraft Millworks, uh, Cabinets and Millworks, Tim Fortuna, and they can get that done. They can have a custom cabinet home from end to end. Everything. Absolutely. All of our product that we build, it's all real, nothing synthetic or man-made like the MDFs and the particle boards. It's all real veneer core plywoods. Um, well, Tim, it's been a great learning experience for us. It's great to know that we have your talents here in our community. If you would, before we go, would you tell the audience a couple of ways they can get a hold of you, maybe your uh, phone number, the location of your showroom, which is not far from where we're at here in HKMC studio, and uh, maybe uh, an email address or website that they can reach you at. Okay, uh, well, I'm about two miles up on the same side as this building here. Um, address is 1270 Whiteville Road, and the... Um, our website is timbercraftcabinetsus.com. Uh, that's a good tool just to see some of our work. You can reach me at 910-755-3397 is the phone number to the shop and or the showroom. And or you can reach me through email, which is tfortuna at timbercab.com. Well, Tim, thank you for being on the show today. We've really enjoyed uh, learning about your business. Thank you for Thank having you. me. Welcome back. I'm here with Lynn Carr Wiggins with Island Classic Interiors to talk about all the amazing things she has to offer in their shop. Lynn, welcome. Thank you. Well, tell us a little bit about the shop. Talk, talk to us about what we have here on the table, some of the items that you brought today. Well, what we have here on the table, we start from if you need help with building your home, we can do that. We can help you pick out paint colors. We can help you pick out flooring, window treatment, ceramic tile. And we have installers that can install all these products. And then we have fat, beautiful fabrics that we can help you make um, custom window treatment, custom bedding, reupholster furniture. We have people that can do all of that. And then we have beautiful accessories that we can help you accessorize your home. And then we have beautiful gifts that you can, you might not, you might need a wedding gift, a birthday gift. We have all different kind of lines of gifts. We can wrap them for you. We can deliver them for you. So we're a full service interior design gift shop. Oh, wow. That's great. It looks like so if somebody wants to go come in and just do one thing, they can do it. Or if they want to say, Lynn, we want a turnkey job. We're building a new house on the beach and we want a beach theme. Can I just turn you loose and you do that for me? Yes, sir. We can do, if you just want a kitchen backsplash added to your home, we can do that. If you need total job, you're building a new house, we can help you with that. If you want just a beautiful plant to cover up a wall outlet, we can do that. <laughs> so we have a little bit of everything. We have all different services and and you can even walk in off of the street and buy a gift, look, browse around. We'll even sell you fabric. We don't have to make your window treatment, but we can make your window treatment. If you want to cover your own pillows, you can do that. If you want to us to do it, we can do that as well. And if there's something you don't have, you can, you can order it for us or find a resource to get that item? If it's a line that we carry, we can get it for you. If it's not, we can always, if you have an idea in mind and you can explain that idea to us, we can help you find something that we think you'll be satisfied with. You um, added the accessory lines, just how, how recently have y'all done that? We've had the, the gift lines around about five years now. And it's been really popular. It has been. And a lot of people still don't realize we have 
such nice gifts, but we're getting the word out there and people are learning that we do have gifts and we even, we've added a baby line and we've added some personal, um, like some jewelry and just, um, we have wonderful candle lines. So we've got a good line of gifts and it's just a place that everybody needs to come see. That's a good, you know, my wife, she gets out, she has her girlfriends that come down to the beach mm. and spend the weekend with her and they've got their little route that they run. And this is good information because I, I, we didn't know. And I'm sure there's a lot of people in the audience because Island Classic Interiors has been there for 27 years. And you were telling us before the show that it started out primarily dealing with builders, mm -hmm. helping builders and their clients get what they needed to design their interiors of their homes, their couches, their paints, their backsplashes, all these different things. But it has grown into this where folks can just come in and shop too. So that's that's great for our, our audience, our viewing audience to know that they need to put this as a stop when they're that's here at right. the beach making their rounds, shopping for gifts to take back home mm -hmm. too. That Island Classic Interiors is not just for the folks that are building here or own a home here, but the local shoppers need to stop in and see you folks too. That's exactly right. So you tell your wife, she needs to put it on her agenda. It'll be on her list because she will see this show next month and uh, or this month and she'll know that uh, she'll say, you need to show me where that's at. <laughs> what kind of items do you have on your baby line? Is it baby gifts? Mm -hmm. okay. We do, we have baby blankets, pillows, um, frames, um, stuffed animals. It's just, it's, no, it, it's not any clothing. It's all like to do with the crib okay. or, and we're going to start a book line. Oh, good. And, um, every, and all of our um, blankets can be monogrammed. I've taken them to a local monogram shop and they can have a monogram added to them. Okay. So, you know, it personali personalizes it some and they're just really good little, and picture frames. Some really, and then some sayings like thank heavens for a little boy or thank heavens for a little girl. Just little sayings, little crosses, just things you can hang on the wall. So it's more gift type stuff that you would give to an expectant mother. Can you start a wish list? Oh, yes, okay. ma'am. We, we have plenty of people that have their little card at the shop that they come in they say, well, you know, I tell my husband I want this. So we write things, you know, we have your name and Good. can write it down. And, and then we also do gift certificates, too, for people that, you know, just they say, I don't know what my friend wants, but she loves to come in this shop. So we recommend her a gift okay. certificate if we don't have a wish list on that person. But, yeah, come by. We'll make you a wish list. And the baby gift line is something that's fairly new, right? Yes, we've only had that just about a month now, wow. so it's brand new. And it's always good to be thinking outside the box and think of what it, what is another piece of the puzzle that I can add to my shop, to my store, mm -hmm. to my design work that people may not have access to. And there's not that I'm aware of a whole lot of just baby stores around so that's a great mm -hmm. feature to have at your store it is and we've done well with it so far and we're hoping it'll even get better mm -hmm. well that's what we're here to do <laughs> Lynn is to help you uh, get some exposure and let the folks out in the community know exactly what you got to offer to them do you have any interesting um, decorating stories you want to share maybe a fun time that you got to decorate something unique that maybe like a pool house or <laughs> a garage or something different. Have you ever had an well, experience with that? Most of our experiences, I think they're all unique mm -hmm. and they're all fun. So it's just, it's just fun working with different people and it's fun doing just a house from just a blank room to put, you know, using other people's items and pulling new stuff in with their stuff because that's always rewarding to people to know, oh, you you were able to use some of the stuff that I had. So all of our experiences are, are unique. And so I don't have one that I could really put my finger on and say, oh, this has re been, re been really neat. But all of them have been good. Well, we, great. well, we appreciate you being here today and learning a lot more about your about Island Classic Interiors and the fact that we can go shopping in there. I think it's amazing. And if you want to tell our audience where the, how they can reach you, how they can find you, 
let us know up where you're located. Okay, well we're Island Classic Interiors at uh, 115 Causeway Drive, Ocean Isle Beach, and our phone number is 910-579-8477. And we have a website, um, www.islandclassicinteriors.com. Thanks, Lynn, for being on the show today. We appreciate uh, you being here and all the great things that you brought for us to share with the audience. Well, thank you. Thank you it was been, been fun. Welcome back, folks. We're here with Sean Gamsby of More Space Place for our third segment of the show today. Sean, welcome to the studio. We're glad to have you here. Uh, Great to, to be talk here. a little bit about what you and your family do with More Space Place in North Myrtle Beach, and I understand you have a location in Wilmington also. Yes, sir. Yes, we have one in uh, Wilmington. We've been there for a few years now, and, uh, and in North Myrtle Beach, we've been there for eight years. Wow. Now, the tagline for More Space Place, America's Murphy Bed Store. But you're more than just a Murphy bed store, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. We're, we're uh, custom cabinetry. We do custom closets as well, uh, garage units, um, everything but the kitchen and the bathroom. So when you say more space place, you can think about the fact that you can take the products that you bring to the community, to the people, and make more space in their room through organize, organized cabinets, through Murphy beds, and you might want to explain a little bit about Murphy beds and how they work. And I know sure. there's more than just the Murphy bed, there's other types, panel beds too. Right, we have a, a whole line of, of different styles of Murphy beds um, that are used in all different um, rooms, uh, whether it's uh, a room above the garage where you have the knee wall. Uh, we have beds that are on, the, on its side. Um, so if you don't have the height, um, we also, we have ones that open up, book, that have bookshelves on the front and open up and then you have the bed. Uh, we have ones that slide open. Uh, we have all different types and uh, it, we have a few of the samples here and all different uh, wood grains, um, styles that you can choose from and the cabinets that go with it. Uh, there's, there's thousands of combinations. You'll see in our showrooms uh, that we have a few setups that we can show you of ideas of where we put a, a Murphy bed with the home office, um, where you can use that room as a home office majority of the time. And then when you do have your guests, you can pull your bed down and have it as a guest room. When we were down in the showroom, Sean, we also saw some really unique closet setups where uh, you've got shelves, you've got, you can actually put like furniture, like a, a built-in cabinet with, uh, or wardrobe in the, closet space? And just like in the home office and the Murphy beds where we have thousands of combinations, we also have thousands of combinations in the closets and which the ladies usually like. Um, you can really organize your closet and maximize every inch of it by putting a double hang section in and then having shelves maybe for shoes or sweaters or purses. Um, and then even adding drawers to it. There's a, there's a lot of uh, different uh, ways that you can maximize your space. We have corner shelves that go around so we don't waste any space. I think what struck me when we were looking at the closets, being a female, I love seeing closets, is mm -hmm. that the closet wasn't any bigger than what you would normally see in a, tr a typical master suite. I mean, it wasn't like there were massive size closets, right. but the use of the space and the way you um, organized the, the drawers and the shelves made it feel like you were in a much bigger room. It, and then having that little island thing in the middle. It does. Uh, it really, uh, you know, when you can go to every inch and, and organize it, it does seem bigger. When it's clean and organized, it's amazing how big spaces feel. Um, and we, we come and we measure your closet, whether it's just a walk-in um, or just a reach-in. Mm -hmm. um, you, can, you can utilize those spaces a lot better than uh, what a lot of people have when they purchase their home. Um, so there's a, there's a lot of different ways, different closets. We'll come and we'll, we'll measure, get your ideas of what you're looking for, and then we design it for you up on the computer for you. And then also, uh, we covered the closets for the ladies. Uh, the men can have their garages done the same way. You have all types of designs for cabinetry and storage space and hanging racks for 
basically anything a man or a woman, for that matter, could have in their garage space so that they can utilize that. I've seen so many times I'll be driving down the street and I'll look and there'll be this nice two-car garage and both the cars will be sitting in the driveway and I think, <laughs> They need more space place. <laughs> Absolutely. There's a lot of places uh, I've, I've driven by and the, the garage doors open and it's just full of stuff. Right. Well, that's where our cabinets come in handy in the garage. We have them up off the floor, um, being that it's an outside space. Um, so we keep all of our cabinetry on legs up off the floor. Um, and we do slat wall where it has grooves in it and there's different accessories that you can hook into them and I mean, if you've ever had a garage before and you buy stuff and you have a ladder hanging on a, on a hook and then you get a hose and then you, want, you buy something else and that's where you want it to go. Well, now you got to unscrew it, move it, and you have holes everywhere. Now you just take your accessory out, snap it in a different place, and it can go from shelves, uh, paper towel holders, screwdriver holders, all different things. You can hang bikes off of it. Um, wow. So they're up out of the way and you can still pull your car in the garage. So you can conform that as you as your uh, needs grow. You can change it without having to repaint walls and hang new sheetrock. You just move, move it in the slat wall and get what you need based on that. Correct. That's awesome. So, is there any other things that uh, we've missed while we've been talking about this? We talked a little bit about the Murphy beds. We talked about home office space. We talked about uh, being able to uh, utilize closet space to the best of your abilities and we've also talked about um, garage space. I guess one thing that we could talk about that we were talking off camera before was the fact that you can do this on a house that's already built but especially on new construction. You mm -hmm. want to tell a little bit about how that sure. works? Sure, there's a lot of, uh, lot of building going on in Myrtle Beach right now um, and a lot of people are coming in uh, when they're at the blueprint stage of building their house uh, before they even break ground sometimes. Um, and they come in and they show us uh, on the blueprint what room that they're wanting to do something in and uh, we can get into designing right off the blueprints. We'll take a copy of them for you and uh, the measurements and then Mary Ann will get into designing a, a unit up for you and that way if if a wall does need to move maybe an inch or two, it's not a big deal when it's on the blue, just on the blueprint stage. And you said Mary Ann, she is your in-house architectural design person, so yes. she is licensed to be able to, I mean, she's got the education and the background and she's been doing this, she knows how to. She's an architectural to, engineer, she's right. a, a very good at organization. Uh, Keeps our house pretty organized. <laughs> <laughs> Saying that, uh, Mary Ann's his fiance also. And and also, this is, a, like I said at the beginning, this is a family-based business. It's it is. you, your fiance, and your mother and father, right? Yes. And the fur kids. Yeah, and the, and the dogs, absolutely. Yeah, so, uh, Sean, with all that said, uh, could you tell the audience a little bit about your locations? I know we've got a location in... North Myrtle Beach, and what is that shopping center that that's in? That's in Gator Hole Plaza. Gator Hole Plaza, and then there's one now in Wilmington. Uh, Correct, that, on Oleander Drive. Oleander Drive, mm -hmm. okay. And I think you also said you're expanding to We're looking south. to open up another store uh, very soon out in, uh, down in Surfside. Well, that's great. That's great to hear that uh, your business is growing. Yeah. And the territory that you can cover for folks out of the Myrtle Beach and Wilmington location, you'll go out about how far hour-wise from Well, we usually go anywhere between three and four hours okay. away. We go basically from Charleston all the way up to Charlotte, Raleigh, and okay. Fayetteville. Okay. So, Sean, if you would, uh, give our viewing audience a little information on how they can get a hold of you folks down at your North Myrtle Beach, North Myrtle Beach location at Gator Hole Plaza. Sure. You can just give us a call at 843-249. 4200 or you can go on the web at morespaceplace.com thanks for being Thank here Sean. Thanks, thanks for you. having me well that concludes our june edition of our chamber highlight show we hope you enjoyed learning about the interior decorating the the uh, timber craft the customized cabinets and our last guest sean with more space place Check out our Chamber website for all of our upcoming events and uh, Chamber activities going on in the community. You can do that at BrunswickCountyChamber.org. You can also call the office at 910-754-6644. Have a good one.